play your next game. They have outscored their opponents 87 to 17 the last two weeks. 17 points given up to Texas A&M with Jimbo Fisher, mm -hmm. offensive oriented coach, and this big bad Georgia defense, which is good. Uh -huh. But every week, didn't we hear it? Mm -hmm. Finally, we're going to find a defense to slow LSU down. First, uh, we heard it was Florida. Then we heard it was Auburn. Then we heard it was Alabama. Then A&M and Georgia. I'm still waiting. <laughs> yeah. Georgia so giving them 10 points a game coming into this one. LSU gets 37. Now, the next member of our crew that is out there is Andrew Doak. He is in Atlanta. He is standing by. But a few minutes ago, he caught up on the field with a second. But I, I guess everybody who's watching Joe Burrow perform got to celebrate here in the city, including at the wrong area on the Greenway. Erica Ferrando was there live with all of these fans who got to watch Joe Burrow perform and watch the LSU Tigers win the SEC championship. Erica? <laughs> because then they'd have to admit they were wrong in the other weeks about the more complete team. Mm -hmm. Now what do you do? Back-to-back -back weeks now, seven points you gave up defensively, ten points you gave up defensively. Um, if it's a close game, I think LSU's got a shot. But again, w this committee, what they do, they like fishermen. They keep throwing the bait out for you to debate. They want you to watch their shows, and it makes it interesting. But they are hard-headed, mm -hmm. and for the last month, they have sunk into that Ohio State, the more complete team. Yeah, they have flopped a couple of times. I think it could go LSU's way. I'm a little more optimistic for LSU. Say, Ed Ogeron now walking up to the podium. Let's hear an LSU's post-game Atlanta, but also here in the metro area. And right now at the wrong hour, that party is ridiculous right now. Erica Ferrando is live there at the wrong hour right now. Who can barely hear us, but I see a lot of very happy Tiger fans behind you. Well, let me tell you something. Just because the game's over does not mean the celebration is over. There's still a pretty good crowd here at the Wrong Iron, and we have been here for several hours, and people have been partying the entire game. I mean, when you have a game like this, and LSU is playing like they're playing, these LSU fans have been going wild. Take a look at this video. This is from the end of the game. I 
Chinese band were going insane, having so much fun. The wrong iron was packed. I'm talking, you could barely walk through this place, and people were just partying like crazy, and they are still celebrating. We've seen a couple people start to trickle out, but look, it is still a party here at the wrong iron. I want to let you listen to some fans we spoke to right as LSU was winning this game. We look good on both sides of the ball. Honestly, I think a lot of people thought Georgia was going to come out. They had more to play for, but at the end of the day, we're just a better team. Is it the biggest of the game? Absolutely. Multiple scores. That's what I, that's what I expected. Multiple score wins. This team is dominant. Joe Burrow is the go. I know this LSU offense is going to score a lot of points. I know the defense is going to show up. I'm exciting. Go Tigers. It's been great. Uh, as an alumni from LSU, uh, it feels good to finally see our team do what we need for the city and for the state. It's been a great game. Our defense has showed up. Yeah. No, it's been really good. I've seen uh, Burrow just throw some super, like, great passes. It's been some, uh, he's, he's really had a great game. Awesome time. Great time. Great defense. Good game. It was our defense that won the game tonight. You've seen our offense all season. Now you've seen our defense. We won Ohio State. Go, Joe! It's your birthday! We're going to party like it's your birthday! Woo! Go, Tigers! Obviously dominated 37 to 10. Joe Burrow's going to win the Heisman. We're going to take the trophy home and we're going all the way. What's been your reaction just watching touchdown after touchdown? Woo! No, it is. LSU going all the way to the Superdome. Meet us in the Superdome. We won't lose all year. Saints, LSU, baby. Louisiana, number one, baby. Let's go! Number one! My goodness, most people in New Orleans, A, cannot dance, and B, they don't like clothes. Doug, save this thing, please. Yeah, we need to. I think we've had, Erica was great from the wrong iron, but I think it's going to start going downhill. Now, well, sale, sales are up, and everything else is downhill. Uh, that I can guarantee you. No question about it. All right, let's, let's get this back on the football train here. Look, improvement of...